channel and welcome back to another vlog. In today's video, you already know what it's gonna be based on the title. It is everything that I purchased this month. For the month of September, I'm showing you every little thing that I bought and you guys have bought a lot. We are going, or maybe we're already there depending on when this video goes up, but we are going to Disney World very, very soon and I'm so excited. I went Disney crazy. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know I went in, I purchased, I'm, if it had a mouse on it, if it had the Disney logo on it, I was buying it. So it's gonna be a lot of Disney stuff, but it's also a lot of fall clothing pieces, candles, like some favorites in there. And I'm just really excited. This is a good one. I know this is gonna be long, so I don't want this intro to be too long. But if that sounds like something you're interested in, if you wanna see a good collective monthly haul, then please just keep on watching. Okay, so to start it off, I got a bunch of different shorts. I know it's gonna be like 90 degrees there. It's gonna be super hot even in October. So I wanted to get some new shorts for RG and honestly he just needed them. I didn't get shorts for Brie because she has them and they fit fine. So I got a bunch of these like longer shorts. I really wanted sweat short material shorts that were just gonna be super comfortable. So I got green, gray, a light blue, kind of looks like denim, a dark blue. You guys, I'm going through this quick. A light gray and then I got this really cool like tie dye pair which I think are awesome. You're probably thinking how long are you going? That's a lot of shorts. I know, but I also know that like spills happen, things happen, clothes get dirty. So for me, I'm not gonna pack my kids the amount of clothes that we're gonna stay because they're gonna get it dirty. They're gonna have spills. And I personally just don't want them walking around with stains. So I am gonna bring a lot of backups because I mean, things happen. I got this shirt here. This is from Zara. I can't link Zara, but it's from Zara. Super cute for Briella. Then from Etsy, you guys, I've been having like a ton, well, I only had one incident with Etsy that like turned out trash, I'll show you in a minute. But I got these really cute Disney shirts. So I got matching shirts for RG and Briella. It's in the shape of the mouse, which I think is just adorable. Moving on, more matching shirts. I wanted to get them specific shirts for each park that we're going to. So this is gonna be our Magic Kingdom shirt. And then obviously, Animal Kingdom. This is RG's. And then I obviously got a matching one for Briella. We have the super cute Disney princesses uh, shirt. It has Tiana on it and Vogue. And I don't know if you can really see, but like Tiana like got a little makeover. She's like chic, she's slaying, she's ready for the Vogue cover. And then, so I had to get a matching one. It just says Vogue and it has Pocahontas on it. And I just think this is so cute. I plan on pairing this with white denim shorts and then just like comfy, cozy shorts for Briella. And then for Rob, I got this Mickey shirt. It looks like this super oversized. It just says Mickey in the corner. It's like this rubber material. And on the back, it has Mickey Mouse. He's just looking super cool. I got this, it just says Mickey. This is obviously for RG, super cute. This is from Zara. And then I got this one for Briella. It has a mini long sleeve and mini mouse on the back. So we might even wear these on the plane. Okay, and then we have a couple more Disney shirts that actually turned out to be a fail. You can see here, they're not the same color. I tried to contact the shop. I had to go through an ordeal to get my money back because apparently the manufacturer doesn't make this color, but I ordered this color. It was a whole fiasco, but I wanna show you the shirts anyway because I'm sure you can find this um, elsewhere on Etsy, but they are really, really cute. Honestly, I still might bring it. I was a little traumatized at first, but now that I've given it some time, I might still wear this though. Like honestly, it is kind of cute, so I'll probably still bring these. I got obviously for Rob and I, this Heather Gray, and then for the kids, these, um, navy, navy blue ones. I didn't want the navy blue, but we got navy blue. Moving on, okay, I got a book bag for Disney. I literally just showed this on Instagram. It's super cute. It's Coach, it's from the Coach Outlet. This is originally close to $400, and it's on sale for $159, which I think is a really, really good deal for, I mean, technically, I mean, yeah, a designer book bag. I think this is just super cute. It's like the perfect size. I love the chocolate brown and the black and the gold. I just think this is so pretty. I'm literally obsessed with it. it has cushion on the back and then when we get to the parks I will wear this fanny pack I think this is so cute it's matching like this is just really really chic again with like the chocolatey brown the gold hardware the buckle like it cinches in your waist like it actually is very flattering because it cinches in your waist and it covers up like stomach area if, like you're a little insecure about that or you just want that covered this is really nice it like camouflages that so you're like on the go it's just super cute and I have the nerve to have on jeans like why am I wearing jeans? <laughs> 
Okay, so obviously, or I guess it's not obvious, we are taking a plane to Disney. And so I wanted to get some stuff for the plane ride that the kids could be entertained, they could be well behaved, fingers crossed. Archie has been on a plane before, but it was when he was four months old. So like, it's pretty much everybody's first time, really. So I got these little like suction cup toys. Like they look like this, they're little monsters. I figured on the plane, they can stick them on the window or like on, I don't know, like on whatever. I just did that. I don't know why and play with them and I thought they would be really really cute probably not gonna bring all of these because can you imagine the flight attendants would hate us but I'm just gonna scoop out like a good handful put them in a ziploc bag put it in the book bag and be ready to go okay and then I got them each cameras so it says for six-year-olds and up but RG knows how to operate a camera like we're I mean we're vloggers we're influencers like we're on camera all the time so RG knows what to do with ours so I figured he would be fine with this little one I actually have not opened this up oh my gosh this is so cute oh this is adorable okay so it's literally a mini camera like how cute is that you can actually take pictures like there's it's like a smart camera it's a digital camera so they can take their own pictures and then I got a pink one for Briella and I thought that would just be so cute you guys I learned about all these products on TikTok. there is this TikTok, or it's a reel it's on Instagram reels and um, this mommy influencer she created this reel all about like toys and activities for your kids on an airplane So I just literally went to her Amazon store I'll link it down below and bought all of these and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is key So I also got these mess free marker pads. They are different characters. It's a mess free markers I mean, this is nothing new like if you're a mom, you know all about these and then also in the TikTok, you guys I just purchased everything so I got this paint with water animal friend it looks like a blank page, but when you paint it, like the characters sh start to show up. And I just thought this was so, so cute. So I got the animal friend. Oh, I got the, what is this? Farm one and then the underwater one. Wait, I don't know. There's just different animals on each one. Okay, next up. This should be the thumbnail. I got headphones for Briella. RG already has headphones. Briella has a little pink. It's not an iPad. It's an Amazon Fire like tablet thing. So I figured I'd get her pink headphones to match. I don't even know if she's going to be wearing these, but I wanted to get them just in case. Like, I'm just trying, I'm, I just don't want any drama on this airplane. Like, I don't want a situation where they're out of control and they're, and we don't have anything to entertain them. I want backups on backups on backups. I got these little cups. These are so cute. I love these. Moments like this, it feels like I have twins because I'm buying like two of everything in a boy and then in a girl version. I love it. I, this just makes my heart sing. So anyway, I got makeup for RG and then mini for Briella. I did the most. I did not need to get all this, but I literally got this art set solely because I wanted these paint brushes and I'm only gonna bring like maybe like four of these with me. So I definitely went overboard, but for those painting books that I showed you, the watercolor books, I just wanted to get paint brushes, but I got all of this. I figured we could play with this afterwards, like in the playroom, like we could definitely make use of this, but anyway. You guys, I went crazy. We're not done with the airplane toys. If you thought we were done, you're wrong. So I got this doodle like tablet thing. You guys, I'm telling you, the TikTok, the TikTok really influenced me. Basically, it looks like this. You can like color on it like that. And then you press this button and erase it and they can color again. I thought this would be perfect for the plane. Like honestly, they might just be entertained with this and their own tablets and be good to go. Okay, and then I got these wiki sticks. They're basically like these little peel uh, sticks and you can bend them up, you can make shapes. And then I got reusable stickers. I thought could be really, really cool. So we'll see. I have to see like, you know, obviously like what bag we're bringing. All of this can't fit in that coach bag I showed you. So I'm gonna have to sort through and see like realistically like what are we actually gonna bring versus maybe we should just keep some of the stuff here to play with so I'm gonna play it by ear because I got a lot of stuff I know that's a lot okay moving on sticking with Amazon but totally unrelated to Disney is a car mount I have been wanting to get one of these for a while I have so many tripods
tripods, and some of my tripods do have adapters for my phone, but I just wanted a car one. That way, like, I can film reels and TikToks and things like that. So it looks like this. You, I just have to, like, screw this part in here. But basically, you put this on your dash, you put your phone in here, and you're able to film, you know, FaceTime, whatever you need to do. I just thought this was really handy. Then, Bath and Body Works, I got some fall candles. Have to include some fall things in this video. So, I got the scent spiced apple toddy. It looks like this. I just love this packaging. I think it's so cute. I love the black lid. All of this is just very festive, but also tonal and gold. You all know I'm here for that. So this one, obviously it's spiced apple toddy, so it smells a little bit sweet. I like it. It reminds me of leaves. Um, I also got Harvest Gathering. I, I'm really bad at this. It smells good. I, I smell something sweet. I smell maybe a little bit of apple, like maybe pear. I don't know. It smells like a little bit fruity, but also warm. I also got the scent Autumn. Oh, here it is. Autumn looks like this. Love this one. Um, I usually just turn it so you just see the white there. Yeah, again, fruit. Like, all of these smell like fall fruity. That's just what I went for. And then leaves. We all know what leaves smells like. Had to get this one. Woo! All right, y'all. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, moving on. Oh, actually, I got another candle. This, ah! This candle is Veluspa. It's spiced pumpkin latte. Oh, my gosh. Run. This smells incredible. It smells so good like pumpkin latte like just picture like the perfect Starbucks fall drink very creamy very vanilla y um, Yeah, I, like pumpkin but vanilla cream not coffee. I don't know baked good even it just smells incredible It smells amazing. I absolutely love this beauty products time here. We go first up Kiehl's creme de corpse lotion I know you have heard of this or you've probably seen this before it's very popular and for good reason it is so hydrating it's like Palmer's cocoa butter but upgraded like it just is so good can nip nip I don't I'm not really sure how to say this but it's goodbye stress aromatherapy bubble bath you guys I love this brand so much I have not tried this I'm excited to try it but it's basically a bubble bath and then to go along with it I got all of these different bath salts it's the goodbye stress the same the same scent the same um, experience I guess so the reason why I got all four of these these little ones is because they didn't have like one big one or else I would have just gotten that but I love this brand so much it actually works it feels so good it feels so relaxing I love taking baths like lighting candles taking baths like that's my me time my self-care I also got another one this is the lavender scent I have used this one before I'm telling you this is what you need to do okay I'm gonna put you on pour this in your bath under the running water it creates bubbles it's just so luxurious I absolutely love this light some little tea candles around your bathtub in your bathroom wherever you want it to be and then on your phone this is what you need to do you need to download the calm app I'm telling you you will be transported to like a different realm it is so relaxing that calm app is basically like it has meditations on there it has it's just a it's just calming like you put on the different like soundscapes you can listen to rain you can do guided meditation they have bedtime stories which I highly recommend my favorite is the bedtime story Story by Tabitha Brown oh my gosh it is so good I don't know if it's because like I obviously have like a deep-rooted connection to the South so like the story just speaks to me but it's bomb like I highly recommend it I listened to that bedtime story I can't think of the name of it had this in the bathtub had the lights set up and I was just it was it was almost emotional because it felt so relaxing and so good it was exactly what I needed 10 out of 10 recommend okay that was a lot <laughs> Okay, moving on. I'm trying out a new brand. It's called OC. Osea? OC? I'm not really sure. Uh, this is the Body Balm and the Body Oil. I use these together. Oh my gosh, it is so hydrating. It smells citrusy. And usually I'm very particular about citrus. Like, I don't want to smell like orange all the live long day. But there's something about this citrus that I love. So if you're also not the biggest fan of like citrusy smells, try these. I think you'll really like like it. This is so incredibly hydrating. When you pump it out into your hands, you're going to rub it together and put it on your skin. And then you're going to be like, wow, this is really lightweight. I don't know if this is going to do anything. But as you apply like more up your arm, you're going to be like, wow, this is actually like oily, but in the best way. 
it's exactly what it's called a body balm picture like a like thick lip balm that you have to like put your finger in to like scoop some out that's what this leaves your skin feeling like like just super hydrating but it's so lightweight it's weird honestly like I put this on I was like oh I'm about to be ashy in an hour I already know but I'm telling you like the more I rubbed it in I was like wait a minute this is actually hydrating this is transforming this is turning into something that it was not when I first pumped it out so I highly recommend this also the body oil is nice I put this on top I'm glistening I'm hydrated I feel good I look good I smell good this is like the winning team okay moving on I got a couple skincare things first is this fresh sugar face polish I don't think I've ever tried this before I've tried fresh in the past but I don't think I've ever tried this exact um, exfoliator I just needed a good exfoliator I've actually been I got my first hydra facial a couple weeks ago and I'm in love with it the first week was a little rough it was a little shaky because I was peeling I had a couple breakouts after the facial I was like I don't know what did I just do did I aggravate my skin but after that first week it was like brand new skin like I I don't know if you can really tell it I mean I have makeup on so you probably can't even like tell a difference but it really made a big impact on my skin so I was like I want to get some new skincare to like celebrate and then I also got this Kiehl's ultra facial cream I love this I've tried this before as well it's a great just everyday basic gentle face lotion and I love it and then I'm also um, I told you I'm trying out this new brand Osea or OC this is their C biotic water cream moisturizer I really really like this I don't know if I like it more than this one but it is nice it does feel like your skin is drinking a glass of water and I like that feeling so I'm gonna keep using this <gasps> All right, y'all, let's go. Let's keep it moving, keep it moving. Okay, next up, I got some loofahs. This is probably not exciting, but I got some black loofahs. I just wanted them to be aesthetic in the bathroom because you all know we're working on um, kind of, I guess, just like updating the bathroom and getting it looking chic and cute. And then, oh, I forgot these for Disney. I got bows for Briella. First is, is this Mickey? Yeah, Mickey Mouse on a little bow. I figured, I don't know why. <laughs> I figured she could wear it on the plane. This would be super cute. And then I got these little bows it looks like frozen well it reminds me of frozen we could do piggy tails and then for animal kingdom you guys how cute is this i'm obsessed with this one i love the cheetah print i love the little ears because i figured as much as i do want to get like ears for her she's not going to keep that on she's two years old she's going to be pulling that thing off it'll be cute to get it take pictures like a mother daughter moment but she's not keeping that on throughout the park like i know she's not so i figured this would be cute to like wear her ears but like they're not really ears but they are and then I got these two bows they look like this let me take one out these are just so stinking cute I can't get over it you have Minnie Mouse on the bow I got new glasses I had to go to the eye doctor my prescription changed these are what my new glasses look like they're Versace and they're really pretty and yeah so this is me because I can't see I'm like literally blind okay moving on to the last things in this haul the last things are going to be fashion clothes clothing items. Now, the way we're going to do this is I'm going to be sharing what I got for the kids, but I also plan on doing like, I don't know, like maybe like a fun IGTV video where I do like a, I don't know, like family fashion show and like show you all some of our fall fashion looks that we're going to be wearing. But I also want to create like a blog post of everything I bought. Basically, I went in, I went crazy. The kids have a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, you see the laundry basket. The kids have a whole bunch of stuff. I got a whole bunch of stuff for myself. So I don't want to to have this video be 18 years long. So I'm gonna split some of this stuff up, okay? Just to kind of like disperse it so it's not so like crazy. So anyway, let's start with the kids. Most of this is Zara, so I can't link it, but it's Zara. Definitely check out Zara, you all know. I, I go hard for Zara. So first up, this is Briella's pink little long sleeve shirt, a tan long sleeve shirt, and a white long sleeve shirt. Okay, moving on, more Zara for Briella. How cute are these? I just thought these were so like, Trendy and cute and I absolutely love that they're like cuffed up at the bottom I think these are a little bit too long now but by the time it gets cold enough to wear stuff like this here she'll be able to fit then I got these little overalls again just like so adorable with like a white sweater underneath I love how it's like crisscross in the back the straps are ruffled like this is just adorable okay and then I got this plaid dress it has a little hood on the back like it's just very very cool with like stockings or leggings and like boots I think would be really really cute then I had to get her this shacket I have a couple shackets as well I'm just picturing
picturing like a mother-daughter moment with the shackets, super cute, and just like fall vibes. Then I got her this coat. It's kind of like a, it's kind of like a little puffer, a little bit. I figured this would be like her go-to winter coat. It has the Sherpa lining on the inside, beige, so you all know I'm all about that life. I just think this is adorable. Okay, and then I got her this little scarf. How cute is this? I just think this is so adorable with like one of those long sleeve shirts, a shacket, like just would be so cute. And of course I had to get a little matching hat with the pom pom. Oh my gosh, you guys, could you die? Look at how cute these little mittens are. Like stop, they're so adorable. These are gonna be so cute. And then, okay, I couldn't pass this up. I don't know if she's actually gonna be keeping these on, but like I just had to try, I just had to get these. They're so cute. Like obviously they're little earmuffs with the little like bear ears. I'm in love with these. I love the color. I just, this is gonna be a moment. Okay, this is random. This is from Target. I got her little butterfly clips. This was kind of impulsive. I just remember being a little girl and having butterfly clips in my hair. Let me know in the comments if you were obsessed with butterfly clips too. Oh, actually more Disney stuff. I got Disney PJs from Gap. It's just a long sleeve and uh, long pants. This is mini. I'm not gonna open these. And then I got Archie and Briella, these matching ones. Mickey and friends, I thought it would be super cute. You guys, I'm taking full advantage. Listen, you have to think, Disney is expensive, okay? It's thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. So I just really was like, you know what? I'm taking full advantage of every single moment. We're getting the Disney PJs. We're taking pictures in the hotel, in the Disney PJs, the Disney shirts, all of this. Like we're going Disney crazy because we're just, we're spending so much money on it. I just feel like I'm not trying to waste a single second. I'm not trying to waste a single look. So I got a bunch of stuff. And then I also got these Disney princesses ones. It's just long sleeve, long pants. You know the drill. Oh, and then another one. This is for RG. Since Briella has the princesses, RG has uh, Simba, which I think is so cute. I have been loving this for Briella's hair. It's called Alake Naturals Wake Me Up Curl Refresher. You guys, this is good. Like usually curl refreshers or just sprays in general just feel like water and it leaves the hair just feeling wet and nothing special. And maybe it smells good. It's wet and it smells good, which is like, I mean, like I need a little bit more. This is amazing. Like it actually makes the hair feel super hydrated and creamy like you have actual product in your hair. It does everything that you want a curl refresher to do. I really like this because Briella's hair gets dry. Like she's rolling around all over the place. I try to keep it like kept and hydrated, but she likes to go crazy. The girl likes to run around. And so using this in the mornings is key. I find myself not needing to apply as much um, like leave-in conditioner and like a moisturizer after I use this. Her hair feels, it feels perfect. Like this is perfect. Okay, and then I got this eczema honey skin soothing moisturizer. It looks like this it smells so good. It smells just like honey. Like it's def oh, actually, it doesn't smell good. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Wait, but it's, she smells good after using this, but smelling it out of here, I'm like, wait, that smells actually a little strong, a little earthy, if you know what I mean. But on Briella, like she smells good. Like she smells like the slightest bit like honey. So I don't know, that was weird. Anyway, it's, ba oh, it looks like this inside. It's basically like a balm sort of, it's for eczema. Briella has very sensitive skin. Briella and Rob, actually, she gets it from Rob. Rob has very sensitive skin. He, around this time of year, every year gets like an eczema breakout. So yeah, Briella experienced a little bit of eczema kind of like on her mouth right here, but I was freaking out, I was panicking. So I wanted to get this and this actually really, it helped, it really helped, it helped clear it up. We also gave her oatmeal baths. So Briella <laughs> is on like a specific skincare, body care routine. I'm not gonna say she has a lot of eczema. I don't wanna like claim that, oh yeah, she has eczema. She's never been like diagnosed, but I just, I just recognize it because Rob, experiences it and so I recognized it on her face and I was like oh my gosh this is what it is let me treat it so yeah again we didn't go to a doctor if your child has eczema go to the doctor but we tried this and it worked I went back to using and if you've been falling for a while you might remember this I don't know I used to use this so luxury bath soak on her and it really really helped her skin with the baby acne so I went crazy and I got like a bunch of stuff so I got this so luxury bath 
bath so it's a coconut and oak milk bath again we have used these products on Briella when she was a baby we got a cleansing bar as well I also have another cleansing bar upstairs this brand is just awesome we love it okay now back to the clothes now we're gonna move on to RG so I got a two pack of long sleeve striped shirts super cute so I got more long sleeve shirts for RG very beautiful fall colors but this is more of like an orangey red and this is more of like a cherry red I guess okay and then I got a brown long sleeve shirt and a kind of olivey olivey brownie kind of color uh, more Disney stuff oh my gosh you guys I got this Mickey sweatshirt for RG how cute is this like come on this is so cute I absolutely love it I think this is so cool this could even be just like a nice keepsake for you know when the kids get older and we keep this in like a little box of all the Disney stuff and like we could be like oh you were so tiny you could fit in this so I just think this is really cute and then we got this Disney shirt again I was kind of thinking like this being like one of the backups like if one of the the Etsy ones get dirty I can pull this one out and he could wear this then I got this kind of like sweatshirt material Rob has one just like this I figured they could have a really cute father-son picture and then oh my gosh you guys this coat right here this is so cute this is my favorite purchase out of all of the fall fashion finds this is my favorite it's from Zara this is just so cute like the letterman jacket like stop like this is adorable like with sneakers and like skinny jeans I just feel like this is so cool and stylish and I cannot wait to like dress him in this I can't wait for the weather to finally break and get cold so we can wear things like this and like get pictures and oh my gosh you guys okay and then next up I have this zip up hoodie this is for RG as well it has I don't even know what this says no bad days anymore I'm rolling in the good moments okay cool so it looks like this and then it has um, joyful moments written on the hood I just think this is really really cute and then to go along with that it came with matching oh wait these are I pulled the wrong pants <laughs> these are pants he's been wearing forever okay well it came with black sweatpants just imagine me holding black sweat sweatpants that match that okay and then black skinny jeans for RG I just thought these were really really cute are they skinny jeans or like jogger style I don't know but really really cute jeans and then the last pair of pants are these plaid ones I thought these would be really really cute with one of those orange terracotta shirts that I showed you earlier and these are just so fun oh my gosh you guys Woo! okay that's it we made it we made it to the end if you stuck around this long let me know in the comments say I'm still here I'm still standing because that was intense I that was a lot okay Okay, hopefully you all enjoyed this video. The laundry basket is empty. We did it. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, like I said, don't forget to check out my blog. I'm gonna do more fashion pieces that I purchased for myself on the blog post so that you can just shop it, see what I purchased. Definitely follow me over on Instagram as well because I'm creating IGTV videos. Like I said, I wanted to do like a family fall fashion show type video on Instagram. I'm creating reels over there every single day pretty much much and we're just having a blast so definitely go over there and follow so you don't miss any of the fun but yeah you guys I really hope you all enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up make sure you subscribe hit that bell notification so you never miss an upload and we all of my monthly purchases but more specifically me and my Disney purchases okay cheers for going Disney crazy we will see you all in the next video thank you so much for watching bye guys